Cloud computing is perhaps the biggest development in tech world. It has not only revolutionized technical operations across the world, but has also made business more efficient. And cloud computing is certainly here to stay. As per 2021, cloud computing is a $332 billion industry looking to only grow further in the coming years. Here comes the main question. What really is cloud computing? From individual users on their home computers to a big businesses, data processing happens at a remarkable rate today. Cloud computing is essentially a process that allows users to store their data, programs and apps over the web. This allows users to access their data anytime, anywhere. Now, let's understand the concept of cloud computing in little more detail. Cloud computing is named as such because the information being assessed is found remotely in the cloud or a virtual space. The company provides users with cloud services that make it convenient for them to store and access all relevant files, application and data on the internet. This great discovery helped users immensely in using and surfing their data and files from any remote or far-flanged location. Cloud computing has many varieties. While small and individual users rely on file synchronization and backup services like Microsoft OneDrive, Google Drive, Apple iCloud, etc., big businesses often tend to rely on three major kinds of cloud computing. Now let's understand types of cloud computing. Cloud computing providers offer their services according to a different models, of which the three standard models as per NIST are Infrastructure as a Service IAAS, Platform as a Service PAAS, and Software as a Service SAAS. SAAS or Software as a Service where companies use web-based on-demand softwares for their processes. This frees them from the task of maintaining and securing their own software which now becomes the responsibility of a service provider. PAAS or Platform as a Service where businesses specific applications are created for use of a company employees. The third and perhaps the most popular and fastest growing is the IAAS or Infrastructure as a Service. Here industry giants like Amazon, Google and other provide spaces that can be rented out by other companies. On the basis of deployment, clouds can be broadly classified as public clouds. Public cloud is handled and controlled by third party companies who has a control of all the hardwares, softwares, etc. They provide their services on servers and storage on the internet. To avail these services, users have to use their authorized account with their name. Private clouds. Being organization or companies generally use private clouds reserved only for them and can't be used for the other users. Hybrid clouds. Hybrid clouds are the one, as the name implies, a combination of both public and private services. This type of model allows the users more flexibility and helps optimize the user's infrastructure and security. In all of these, a vendor provides all of the essential services. It eliminates the need for a business to create added software and software infrastructure, which proves to be highly cost effective and a lot more efficient. Now we'll move quickly to another segment where we are going to understand different functions of cloud services. Functions of cloud services are as follows. Now moving forward, we'll see why cloud computing has become such an important and integral part in today's day and age. In short, take a look at the advantages of cloud computing. Advantage number one, cost. Use of cloud computing helps in minimizing the cost of hardware devices, softwares, electricity cost, and other resources. Advantage number two, speed. Most cloud computing services provides faster access to the data, be it documents, pictures, or videos. 
without the help of cables or any other external devices. Advantage number three, productivity. It helps in increasing the productivity of users by getting rid of any hardware setups, software patching, and other time-consuming miscellaneous jobs. Advantage number four, performance. All the cloud computing service providers uses upgraded, latest, and fast hardware solutions to run on a network of secure data centers. Advantage number five, reliability. Cloud computing makes data backup, disaster recovery, and business continuity easier and less expensive because data can be mirrored at multiple redundant sites on a cloud provider's network. Advantage number six, elasticity and scalability. Cloud scalability in cloud computing refers to an ability to increase or decrease IT resources as needed to meet changing demand. Scalability is one of the hallmark of the cloud computing and the primary driver of its exploding popularity with businesses. Cloud elasticity is a system's ability to increase or decrease its varying capacity related needs such as storage, networking, and computing based on specific capacity. Advantage number seven, multi-tenancies. It enables sharing of resources and cost across the large pool of users. It allows for centralization of infrastructure in location, which in turn help in reducing cost, peak load capacity, increases, etc. At the end of this video, let's talk about what career options do young IT professionals have in this field. In today's scenario of IT world, cloud computing is one of the most demanding and rapidly growing career domains. Statistically, nearly 90% of the companies across the world are already on the cloud. Moreover, most of the organizations spend more than one third of the part of their IT budget in cloud services. They can choose from multiple options to make an entry to be either a cloud developer, cloud security engineer, front-end and back-end developer, system operations administrator, development operations administrator, solutions architect, and various others. To make a mark in the field of cloud computing, you need these basic skill sets or requirements. Upgrades with cloud technology and platforms. Understand the cloud computing fundamentals. Work on other required skills on relevant certifications, do practical implementations. Indeed, cloud computing is here to rule and will require more and more skilled professionals. So if you think you have it in you to make a mark in the dynamic field of cloud computing, go for it. You may have a brighter and a greater future in store for you. So here we come at the end of this video. We'll meet you again with a brand new subject in our next video. And don't forget to like, subscribe and comment on our YouTube channel, Ducat India. Thank you so much for watching.